In this video, we're going to talk about some different ways to insert links into a Google Doc. So the first way is pretty simple. You just type in the URL and you can highlight that text, go up to the insert link button, and it's going to turn that text into a hyperlink. So when you click on it, the preview window pops up, click there, and it automatically takes you to that URL. So that's one option. Um, from this, you can also copy the link, edit the link, or remove it altogether. Now, another way you could do that, and actually let's use that remove button, is I um, type in the URL, then I go ahead and select the text, and I'm going to use my keyboard shortcut. On a Mac, it's Command-K. On a PC, it's Control-K, and that will automatically insert that link. Often when you're looking in documents, though, you don't see the whole URL. Usually you just see a word or a short phrase that describes where you're going. Um, we call that descriptive text. So for example, instead of typing www.google.com, maybe I'll just type the word Google and hyperlink that word. So now I'm going to select this text. I'll do what I did before, go up to the insert link, and here I'll put the URL. Now you'll notice Google is giving me some suggestions based on my text, which is pretty cool too typed that in and now I have the same thing. When I click on it, I can go right to the website, copy, edit, or even remove the link. Now, what's kind of neat is a relatively new feature. If you type a URL, and I'm going to actually paste in a YouTube URL. When I click on this, one of the options it gives me is to replace that URL with either a chip or a link. Now, to see what that looks like, I'm going to replace it with a link. And now it has taken the name of that vi YouTube video and replaced that kind of messy looking URL with that link. What's also neat, when I click on this, same thing, I could go directly to that or I could open it as a preview. So now it opens up this video right here in my Google Doc and I can preview to determine if it's something that I, you know, I want to learn more. Um, I could also, again, share it or open it directly in YouTube. So that's a kind of a, a neat feature here. Now, just to show you what it looks like as a chip, let's try this again. I'm gonna paste that URL, and this time I'm gonna replace it with the chip, and that's what it'll look like. Um, hover my mouse, I get those that same little preview, the same open preview down here, all of that. So those are a couple of different ways to insert links in a Google Doc.